Welcome to the Market Samurai Tutorials. My name is Tyran Shum and inside this tutorial I'd like to share with you how to determine what your keyword is worth in particular in dollars terms. So the first thing you need to do before you jump into this and get straight into this tutorial, what I recommend you do if you haven't had a chance to have a look at it, go in and take a look at how to find profitable keywords and watch that tutorial first because that actually leads straight into this particular tutorial. Without that, you might not understand actually what's going on here. So if you've watched that, that's great. Let's move straight into it. First thing you want to do is just make sure that you've gone through and done your keyword research and you generate your results right down here and analyze all the keywords. And it should provide you with all this information that you see right here for each individual keyword. Now what we're going to be focusing on here is this particular column here, which stands for AdWords cost per click. And let me just define what this all means. Basically, AdWords cost per click defines how much is Google willing to pay per click for your particular keyword. So if somebody types in body cleanse detox on Google and they go straight to and see your ad, then every time somebody clicks on that ad that has body cleanse detox, Google's willing to pay $3.78 per click. And if you can imagine you get hundreds and hundreds of these clicks through, you can make quite a, a nice sum of money, about an average of about a thousand something dollars a day if you got hundreds of these clicks through. And basically that's how that's calculated. This particular value here though is calculated based on 30 days because that's a minimum of what, it, what we're getting. So if you're to rank high for body cleanse detox and you're getting paid by Google $3.78 per click to be able to get clicked on and somebody clicks through to those ads, then you might get paid from Google on average about $1,158.95. Now, I don't want to mislead you or misguide you. These figures here are actual estimations and also good just to get an idea of how much they're worth. And not necessarily these keywords that you see here is something they can easily rank for. And this is based on if you can get on the first page of first ranking of the first page of Google. So you have to be at the number one spot to be able to achieve these kind of results as well too. The other thing I just want to mention is you'll notice that this actually has a high amount of competition. So if you actually want to go and target for this particular keyword, it will be very, very difficult to target. So what we, that's the reason why we've actually gone through and typed in a 30,000 limit to be able to filter through. If you've typed that through, you'll notice that there's only actually a couple of potential uh, keyword terms that we found in this particular niche that allows us to be able to do this. And if you have a look to see how competitive these markets are, then you'll know whether or not it's worthwhile jumping into it. And if it is, as I've shown you in the SEO competition matrix in the previous tutorial, if you're getting mostly greens in that, and then it's a good to go market. And therefore, you can actually start basing your calculations on these figures and getting averages. So let's have a look, for example, detox fax is a keyword that's available. And what it's saying is that Google's willing to pay you $2.38 per click if you're at the number one spot on the Google page rank or first page of Google. And if you're getting an average of roughly about 100 and something clicks per day, 137 clicks per day, you'll probably average about $325 or so. Actually, in actual fact, you're probably, yeah, about $325.35 per day. So if you actually get that value there, then you're actually doing quite well for that particular keyword term. And that's basically how you can determine. Obviously, the higher the amount that you have here, the more income you may generate. But also too, you need to compare as well too to see how many clicks you might potentially get through. So obviously, if you got less, less amount and also to a high amount of clicks, you still might get something very, very high in terms of a dollar value. But if you actually got a very high amount here, maybe $2 and maybe only about 10 clicks, it might not be also commercially viable because you might not get as many uh, dollar values coming through as well. So you need to monitor these numbers and compare them and then afterwards, once you've got these estimations in place, it gives you a good indication of how much it could be worth. And as you can see, detox fast as a, as a keyword is actually quite high, it's getting paid $2.38 per click for the keyword and that's actually a very very high click or cost per click for any any keyword and if you can get something like that that's excellent if you get anything between 50 cents to a dollar that's actually average anything above that you're getting in the to the pretty much the high so that's basically how you can determine whether or not your keyword is a 
very very commercialized keyword that can be actually monetized and help you make money and that's how much your keyword can be worth as well so these are the important fields that you need to look into before you do jump into and decide that this keyword is something that you want to actually monetize into okay if you've got any further questions about this feel free to leave your questions below uh, also to continue to watch through there's a few other tutorials that also show you step by step on how we can provide and also help you benefit from market summarized tools because there's a lot of information in here and uh, this is pretty much it so thank you very very much for watching the market samurai tutorials here if you'd like to see any further tutorials simply go to market tutorials.com and my name is tyron shum and we'll see you inside the next tutorial bye for now